Wondering whether to choose Elementor or Divi to build your next WordPress website? Well, you probably know that making a good-looking website with WordPress alone is pretty hard to do. And with a bit of research, you found that Divi and Elementor make it easy for anyone to create beautiful websites without any coding skills. Divi and Elementor are both very popular page builders for WordPress, but they target two completely different types of customers. So, how do you know which one is right for you? Stay tuned to find out. Hi, and welcome to Website Hosting Rating, where we bring you the latest industry reviews to help you make well-informed choices when launching or growing your website, blog, or online shop. In this video, I'm going to break down these two page builders and walk you through their pros and cons, pricing, ease of use, templates, modules, customer support, and other features to help you make a smarter choice. All right, let's get this Elementor vs. DV review started. Elementor and DV are two different products, but they do have a few things in common. One thing they have in common is their core feature, that is visual drag and drop interfaces. Both WordPress page builders provide you with a drag and drop interface where you can do front end editing to design a stunning website. They both offer you the ability to click on the element you desire, drag it into the position you want it to appear on your web page, and drop it into place. With either of these tools, you'll never need to hire a designer or learn to code. Additionally, both tools come with more style and design settings that are not available in a regular WordPress page builder plugin, giving you more options to enhance the look of your web pages and add more functionality to your website. And that's not all. They both offer fully responsive editing, allowing your web pages to be responsive when viewed through mobile, tablet, or desktop devices. Both Elementor and Divi have their unique strengths and weaknesses. When making your choice between these two page builders, consider these pros and cons. First, let's see where Divi's performs better than Elementor. Divi has more than 800 pre-designed templates, allowing you more flexibility when setting up your website. Divi also has a wide range of website packs for businesses in all industries, helping you find a design that perfectly suits your brand, whether you're a beauty, e-commerce, or landscaping company. And not just that, Divi makes editing page content a breeze, as you just need to point and click to edit any block of text. On the downside, Divi doesn't include a pop-up builder, yet pop-ups are essential when you need to draw the site visitors' attention to special deals or announcements. Some users also complain that Divi has too many options, which means a steeper learning curve. When it comes to Elementor's pros, its users love it for its tons of features, which give you more options to design a charming, and quality site. Its interface is extremely intuitive, allowing you to start using the tool immediately. And when you can't locate something, you can always turn to the search window to help you find what you need. It's also one of the most powerful pop-up builders you can find. Elementor also has some cons. First, it has only 300 plus templates, compared to DB's 800 plus. Second, some users complain its third-party add-ons often cause compatibility issues. Let's dive into Elementor and DV plans and pricing. Elementor has one free and three paid versions. For the free plan, you get a drag and drop editor, 40 plus basic widgets, 30 plus basic templates, among others. The three paid plans are renewed yearly at $49 for one site, $99 for three sites, and $199 for 1,000 sites. For all paid versions, you get 50 plus pro widgets, 300 plus pro templates, a theme builder, WooCommerce builder, pop-up builder, and support for a year. On the other hand, Divi only has two plans, one year access at $89, renewed annually, and a lifetime option at $249, where you pay once and get lifetime access, support, and updates. The two Divi plans give you access to other Elegant Themes plugins, like Bloom, Extra, and Monarch, product updates, hundreds of website packs, premium support, and lots more. As you can see, Divi's lifetime access offers incredible value, and you get to use Divi on an unlimited number of websites. The interface is where we spend most of our time when working with a page builder tool. That's why it needs to be simple, easy, and straightforward. 
Elementor seems to have a slight edge over Divi when it comes to ease of use. Its interface is super intuitive and simple, while still allowing you to design something spectacular. On the other hand, Divi's interface almost has too many options. This makes the tool feel a little bit overwhelming. When you want to save a ton of time when designing your website, pre-made templates are the way to go. Yes, both Elementor and Divi come with huge template libraries, but which one offers more options? Elementor has 300 plus website templates and 100 plus ready to use designs to quickly build out your site. Divi boasts 100 plus website layouts and 800 plus pre-made designs that come with professional design, original photography, and illustrations. In both tools, you can customize the pre-made designs, save them, and use them on other sites. If you want to be able to choose from the most pre-made designs to use, then Divi is your best option. Modules are a critical part of a page builder because they're the actual building blocks of your designs. They are the elements you drag and drop on your site to customize it. Examples of modules are buttons, calls to action, testimonials, contact forms, blog post lists, and pricing tables. Elementor's free version comes with 29 content modules, while the paid plans have an additional 30. Divi, on the other hand, comes with 46 different content modules. Elementor holds a slight advantage over Divi, as its pro version comes with more modules. Both Elementor and Divi excel in customer support. You can reach Elementor's support team through email or get help from their strong community of professional users and developers. On the other side, Divi offers 24-7 support all year via live chat and email. And they have a robust online community that can help you solve most issues you will encounter. If you're looking for the best support in the business, Divi is the tool for you. Users on both sides of the fence are pretty satisfied with the features and capabilities they get from these tools. But to help you figure out which one will suit your needs better, here's my recommendation. If you are new to web design, you want to create your first site, and you're on a budget, then Elementor is the best fit for you. Elementor is an easy to use page builder, has a quicker learning curve, comes with more advanced elements to build your design, and is cheaper for a single website. Now, if you've designed a website before, want to improve your design skills, are looking for more advanced styling options, and want value for money in the long term, then get Divi. Its lifetime plan is just sensational. Whether you have decided to pick Elementor or Divi, I have a special discount code for you today. Head to the description below, click the link belonging to the tool you want, select your preferred plan, and the discount will be applied instantly. And that's it for this video. If you have any questions regarding Elementor, Divi, or any other page builder, feel free to drop a comment below and I'll get back to you with an answer.